All right, we're gonna work on this. I gotta pull some more parts off of this engine. This is our donor twin turbo VG30 DETT. It's a mess. Supposedly it was running when they pulled it and they just let it sit. So we're just gonna harvest some parts off this oil pan, whatever lines are salvageable and uh, put it on this guy here. This is our VG30 DE out of a Infinity J30, same motor, low mileage, came out of a wrecked Infinity. Pick that up for the good deal. There's our five speed transmission we need to go on and all kinds of miscellaneous parts. But what we're gonna do is mock this engine up for our 300ZX there. That way I don't have to do anything to the 300ZX. We can still drive it, enjoy it. And uh, while we're working on the twin turbo NA conversion, we're literally just gonna tur twin turbo NA conversion this engine, get it all ready, drop it in that car, pull that out, and then button it all up together. But I'm gonna strip this down for some more parts today, see how far we get. I need the intake manifolds off. That way we can get this off the stand, that on the stand, start prepping that engine. And uh, really just taking an inventory of the parts that we're gonna need to finish this up. I think I have an idea. Once we keep working on it, we'll know. Somebody needs to be a hot boy. This is the straight pipe exhaust I pulled off my old 350. I know somebody wants it. There's my highly modified uh, 240SX. So I'm a hot boy too, 240SX. Very clean, complete 300ZA. The 240 is complete too, SR20, but it's highly, highly, highly modified. All right, let's get to it. All right, well, we got the turbo and manifold all off that. Uh, this back nut right here is definitely tight to take off. O2 sensor and this back shielding had to come off before we could even get anything in there to take that off. We got our oil line here. Hopefully we can reuse this. The water lines are so terrible. Look, that one's broken. It's full of this rust. Someone was running straight water in here. This is what happens if you run straight water. Your pipes are going to get clogged up with rust and then i mean that was full of rust as well the cooling port on this turbo so you know this turbo is cooked and apply the side look at all the oil i mean it's blowing oil this thing's smoked it's a core we've got this part off but here's everything i've got it all laid out all the parts we'll bag and tag all this so i know where everything goes and uh, how to get it all back. All right, so this is obviously used oil pan. It's got a little scraping, but doesn't look anything crazy. No damage. This is literally like what I bought the engine for, was the oil pan, and I figured I could use other stuff off of it too. And turbo manifolds bonus.
pretty stripped down. We got most of the parts we're going to need for the NA twin turbo conversion off of our donor twin turbo motor. The only other thing I'm questionable about is this oil pump. We do need a twin turbo oil pump, but uh, I mean, we've got one here, but also there's a lot of unknowns about this engine. And for all the work we're doing to prep this, I think it's better just to spend the money, get a new twin turbo oil pump for this. But uh, there we go. We still take the heads off. A lot of nasty oil buildup right there. Let's, I cleaned it all up, vacuumed it up because I can't stand it. Uh, but you can see right there, like sludge city, dude. This has definitely been abused in the maintenance category, which leaves a lot of unknowns for this total engine condition altogether. So we're taking out the parts we do know we can use, I'll leave the other ones. But this is what our twin turbo core motor is looking like. Well, this is what we're gonna work on next. I think we're at about a point where we can flip flop these motors and start taking this down and prepping it. Well, that bad boy right there. Looking good, man. Drove that all around yesterday. So nice. And then I've got all this set up. Uh, we'll tag and bag all this stuff. We'll go through that in a minute. But there you go, core, new, car, boom. All right, well, there's what we got with the heads off. It is a mess. I'll put in the comments down below what y'all think about this. This is ridiculous that someone just left this outside. They literally just left this outside and this is what happened. Twin turbo motor. Oh, now we're gonna use it for parts. There you go. It's the mystery. That is, that's rough. That's rough, my God. Somebody sold this to somebody for like 2,500 bucks or something. So we've got it pretty much squared away, all those parts, bagged and tagged everything with our good little Ziplops and Sharpie. Uh, honestly, most of the parts are up there in that box. This is gonna be like the core parts of what we actually are gonna need for the swap for that car. Hey, Wes is over here. And then we've got our engine on the stand. So nice, that's all ready to go. We can actually start prepping this now. See what we're gonna have to do. Uh, this is what's left of our uh, VG30 DETT that someone just decided to ruin. So we got, we got plans for that. We got plans for that. You know, got all kinds of plans. But uh, that's where we're at on this. Most of the stuff literally just fit in this box. Four turbos. Look how blown up that turbo is. Four turbo there. Five speed swap because you can't have the twin turbo without the five speed. More stuff. Just continue to get this organized. Bam, there you go, clutch pedal. Anybody need a Z31 clutch pedal, let me know. 